Hello friend, welcome to Bricks Embedded System Tutorial. I am Rajiv and in this tutorial we are going to learn how to build a Bluetooth controlled robot. So here is the mechanical part of the robot. Uh, we have connected one Bluetooth. Uh, on Bluetooth you will find four wire VCC ground RX and TX. Uh, I have connected uh, those four wires to the microcontroller. RX is connected to TX. TX is connected to RX other than VCC is connected to VCC ground is connected to ground next uh, you need a mobile which is having a, a blue term software so just run the software and uh, if, if you have already paired the Bluetooth module with your mobile it's okay otherwise you need to do the pairing process once that is done just make a connection select your Bluetooth by default you will see that uh, the LED on the Bluetooth is blinking once it will get connected either the blinking pattern will change or it will stop blinking so now it's connected and you can see that the blinking on the Bluetooth is stopped so now whenever I will send a command from this mobile the microcontroller will receive that command and accordingly the motor will rotate so uh, for uh, microcontroller we need to do the programming so here is the code which we have uh, written inside the microcontroller so here inside main we have written set bot red 9600 this is to enable the uart enable uart rxc interrupt this is to in enable the interrupt on the rx receive this is sei for global interrupt enable ddrd equal to 0b11110000 as we know that we have connected the motors to d4 d5 d6 d7 so we need to make ddr of those four pins high and uh, here it's an infinite while loop and we have written nothing to this now whenever the microcontroller will receive any character on rx pin the rx interrupt will run and this isr will get called in this uh, isr function i have uh, i am storing the received character to the c variable and then we check whether it's w s x a or d on receive of w we rotate the motor so that it will move forward in case of s we stop the all the motors in case of c uh, x it uh, moves backward similarly for a and d it's move left and right direction now uh, let's try to run this uh, we need to run the software so now if i will press w the motor is rotating forward if i am pressing s it will stop for x it will go backward similarly if i will press a it will take a left turn and if i will press d it will go right again for using s we can stop it so uh, this way you can build a simple uh, bluetooth control line follower robot so that's all for this tutorial please keep watching our tutorials to learn more about embedded system and robotics thank you